Good morning, everyone. Unless you're sixth hour, good afternoon. Today's kind of day one of me not being there. So just listen carefully and follow along so that way you kind of know uh, what's going to go on for this unit and in particular for this day, Monday, November 5th. So your agenda for today is you're already doing the first person to watch this direction video. Nice job finding that. Then you're going to look at the packet you were given on the way in. You're going to be answering the November 5th bell work question and only the November 5th bell work question that was given to you by the teacher on the way in. Once you finish that, if you were someone that did not finish the economics DCA last Friday, whether you weren't here or you started it and didn't finish, go talk to the teacher and he should have your DCA in a folder with your name on it. You're going to need to finish that and get that turned in before we kind of get jumping into the government stuff. If you're already done with the DCA or when you're done with the DCA, our main activity for today is going to be this Who Makes the Rules scavenger hunt. You're going to turn that into your class trade just like normal when that's finished. And if you finish all of that, you're going to work on missing assignments or you're going to quietly read a book. The teacher is instructed if you have issues with that, um, that there is additional assignments that may be given to you if you can't handle it from a behavior standpoint, but I'm sure that won't be a problem for any of you. So your items you need to complete today are over here on the right hand side. Um, we're going to be looking at your bell work and just the November 5th question and the who makes the rules scavenger hunt. We're going to get that done today if possible. And you're going to get that from the teacher when you are done with bell work and this video. Our Overall deal, we're going to kind of go over the scavenger hunt here is there are blue papers around the room. If you kind of look on the wall, you'll see those. And those are going to help you answer the questions on that. Who makes the rules handout? And you're going to turn it in when you're finished. Okay. And our overall goal for you to get out of today is we want you to be able to identify some of the politicians that represent you in our representative democracy. And I want you to know some of the information you're going to need when you get older to register to vote. So you take a gain or a couple of the things. You should have gotten the citizenship calendar when you walked in. It's going to be on your colorful sheet of paper. It's very important you don't lose this because especially now I'm not there to give you another one. So please keep it somewhere safe. This is going to take you day by day what we're going to be doing all throughout the unit while I'm there. And especially important while I'm not there. And kind of you can check it off as you go. So once you're done watching the video, you'll be able to check that off. Once you answer the bell question, check that off. And then if you're already done with DCA, check that off. Then hopefully by the end of the hour, you can check off the who makes the rules scavenger hunt. Looking at the bell work, in your packet, you have several bell work papers for several different days. Okay. Very important. It says on every single day, do not work ahead. Okay. Because it's going to be hard for you to answer a lot of questions. And it's going to kind of limit some of the discussion you can have um, with your groups. So, once you to answer this, and then the teachers and give you instructions on when that's okay to talk about it in your small group. This is kind of like what we do on whiteboards, but with me not being there, I wanted to make sure we weren't going to have any issues with running out of markers or whiteboards or any of that business. So let's go ahead and answer just these three questions. You'll notice um, one in three are opinion questions, so just give your honest opinion. So you finish that, wait for teacher instructions, and you'll be having conversations about that. Then when it's time to start, the scavenger hunt, you're going to get this handout. Looks like this. You'll kind of kind of see that it's divided into separate categories, separate areas. Those go with different uh, blue pages around the room. Okay, so you kind of see school board. You're going to want to try and find the blue paper around the room that would say school board information, and that would help you. If you don't want to use the papers around the room, there are links on the direction page for today right below the link for this video. The trickiest sections of it tend to be the um, sections about the state capitol. That'll be the one you'll see the capitol building on. And the state government will be on a similar looking paper as that. And then the last section down here about voter registration. You're going to need to find the actual voter registration form, which is going to look kind of like this. And you're going to pick a few pieces of information off of that. Otherwise, the other place people get hung up is not knowing if they're an independent or Buckner um in which ward or city they live in you'll find maps that will hopefully help if you can't figure it out just pick one and that way you can kind of figure out who the representative alderman or councilman is for that okay do your best it's okay if we can't quite figure a few things out i know it's kind of stressful the first day but i have faith in you guys and remember use your unit calendar to keep track of things and turn in things as you finish as always remember behavior is going to be very important thank you and have a great day guys